Hey guys, this is Randy. I wanted to talk to you today about an area of my prayer life that has been super helpful for me for the last almost 25 years now. And it's part of my everyday morning prayer. And I wanted to just tell you what it is. And um, you can listen and pick pieces, pick it all. It's not a formula, but uh, it's something you might consider trying. And I'd say try it for uh, 21 days. 21 days makes a habit. Uh, so give give it a shot, give something a shot. But um, as guys, we are very sight oriented. And I know this is something that has been hard for me on occasions uh, and how that affects my relationship with my wife. So I'll tell you kind of the basic flow of how this part of my prayer goes. First, I ask for forgiveness. Uh, so being sight oriented, I, I ask forgiveness for things that I've looked at too long. And I also pray uh, for forgiveness for things that I then think about uh, too long. Um, and then pray for forgiveness for the memories uh, that, that come back occasionally for some of these things um, and just to get them out of my head permanently. So next, I thank God. And I thank God, uh, and this is what I say. I say, thank you, Lord, uh, for blessing me with my best friend and my soulmate. And... Uh, I really think this is something that's uh, good to remind yourself of, uh, uh, not just to pray about, but also to remind yourself that once you say yes, uh, that person that you married, uh, she is your soulmate uh, in God's eyes. And so reminding yourself of that is, is very important. Uh, and then lastly, I asked the Lord if he would help me to see the most beautiful, attractive woman in the entire world, both inside and out, when I look at my wife. And I think these three things, praying for forgiveness for things that I, I shouldn't be looking at or thinking of, uh, thanking God uh, for my best friend and my soulmate, and then asking God uh, that he would help me to see her inner beauty every time I look at her, the way he sees her. And this has just been super helpful uh, for me in my marriage, and I thought I'd share it with you. So good luck, guys. See you next time.